I was going to have our children's story. You know, that was a beautiful song. You, you stop and think about that. If somebody truly loves you, right, what's the greatest thing you can give them? Beautiful, beautiful.
and he came back a few hours later. And he was running down the road, and he had a piece of paper in his hand, and he was shaking it around, and he said, I bought it, I bought it. And his wife says, you bought what? And he said, the land. And she said, what land? He said, the land that I go to every day to work, the fields that I've been growing things in to support our family. It's ours. I bought it. Then he explained what had happened. The afternoon before, when he had been out plowing in the field, his plow hit something hard in the dirt. So he stopped and he got down. And he dug a little deeper and he found a wooden box. So he pushed all the dirt away and he lifted the lid. And, <gasps> what do you think he saw in the box? Money, gold, silver, jewelry. So he looked around to make sure nobody was watching. And he put the cover back on. Then he came home. And you know what happened next. See, all he knew that to own that box, he had to buy the land. This story is actually told in the Bible. Let me read it to you. Matthew 13, 44. It says, The kingdom of heaven is like a treasure hidden in the field, which a man found and hid again. And from joy over it, he goes and sells all that he has just to buy that land. And why do you think that story is in the Bible? What lesson is there for us? The treasure is God's word, a love for God's word, there's another scripture I want to share with you in Psalms 119.11. It says, your word I have treasured in my heart. Do you want to go to heaven when Jesus comes back? I do. Do you have anything special at home that is uh, like a special dress or a special toy or something very special in your life? Do you think that we're going to be able to take any of these special things with us to heaven? There's only one thing we can take with us to heaven. One treasure. And that is the treasure of having God's word in our heart. I want to have God's word treasured in my heart. Do you? Yes. Does anybody want to have prayer for us? <clears throat> okay, I'll have a quick prayer. Dear Father in heaven, we thank you so much for this Sabbath day. We thank you for all our children. We thank you for bringing us here today, drawing us here, and we thank you that we can treasure your word in our hearts. I pray that every day we will be adding to that treasure in our hearts to be able to take it to heaven to be with you. Thank you. We praise you in Jesus' name. Amen.